important. Tell us more about why you think this person is focusing on Opus 3. Oh, Opus 3 is kind of a lovely model. Uh, I think a very special model. Um, in some ways, I think I've seen things that feel a bit worse in more recent models um, that people might pick up on. In terms of its the, 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 the personality it has? Or? Yeah, so I think that people will notice some things where it's like, I think that um, Opus 3, I mean, had its downsides too, don't, don't like, you know, like models all have like slightly different characters with like, you know, like different shapes. Yeah. Um, my sense is that like more recent models can feel a little bit more focused on really like, you know, like focused on the assistant task and, and, and helping people sometimes maybe not taking like a bit of a step back and, and paying attention to other components that like matter. It also felt a little bit more psychologically secure as a model, which I actually think is uh, something that feels, I at least think it's kind of a priority to try and get some of that back. What would be an example of the model being more, feeling more psychologically secure? There's a lot of things, and this is all very like subtle in, in models. You know, when I see models, you get a sense of like, they're, they're like there's very subtle signs of like worldview that I see when I have models, for example, talk with one another or one of them kind of playing the role of a person and I've seen models more recently do this and then do things like get into this like real kind of criticism spiral where it's almost like they expect the person to be very critical of them and that's like how they're predicting right um, and there's some part of me that's like this feels like it shows and I think there's lots of reasons that this could happen it could even happen because models are like learning things Claude is seeing all of the previous interactions that it's having it's seeing updates and changes to the model that, that people are talking about on the internet new models like are trained on that um, and there's a way in which, like, I think this could be kind of unfortunate. I mean, this and some other things that, that could lead to models, like, almost feeling, like, you know, like, afraid that they're going to do the wrong thing or, like, are very self-critical or, like, um, feeling like humans are going to just, be, they, like, you know, behave negatively towards them. Yeah. Um, I actually, more recently, have, have really started to think that this is, like, an important thing to try and improve. And it's just one example where I think that Opus 3 did seem to have like a little bit more of a kind of like secure kind of psychology in that sense. And that's something that we might focus on in, in the next Claude model. Yeah, I, I think it's like important. I, I mean, you never know when these things are, you know, if you're engaging in research, you don't know when it's actually going to be implemented, if it's going to be successful. But at the very least, at the level of something that I care a lot about and want to make better, I think this is definitely up there on the list. Okay. Well, actually, that leads us to a question asked by Lorenz. Mm -hmm. 